Hey guys, quick video on these new uh, Altoids tins that are out there. Now, I'm not going to actually make a survival kit. I just wanted to show these tins because I know there's a lot of you guys out there that love making survival kits as much as me. So I just wanted to share that these are out there and that you can get them. You know, as we all know, you know, the Altoids tins have been for years used by people to make survival kits, fishing kits, and you name it. They're small, they're compact, they're portable, you know, they're pretty strong. They're not quite waterproof, but overall they do a, a pretty good job. And people use them, and they have a smaller version, like an Altoid Mini, that's about half the size of this. Well, I was in the store the other day, and I saw this new brand, and I picked one up, and uh, wanted to show it to you, because I think it would make really good for survival kits, fishing kits, whatever, you know. It's uh, just the right size for matches, maybe a small Bic lighter, you know, fishing line, thread, needle, safety pins, razor blades, you know, that kind of fun stuff. You know, use your imagination. But uh, the big difference between this and the uh, tradi tradi bleh, <laughs> traditional uh, Altoids is that it uh, opens from a hinge top like this, which I think is kind of neat because it's a little more protection from the elements. You have uh, less area that opens. Plus the opening, as you can see, is a little bit recessed. So I think it'll give you a little bit Whoops! <laughs> Little trying to do things one-handed, guys. I uh, accidentally left my tripod at a friend's house, and uh, so I gotta make do until I can make my way back out there. Um, but yeah, I really like this uh, hinged top here. As you can see I haven't eaten all these yet, but uh, yeah, really neat uh, Altoids tin. And I know a lot of you are like, "Oh, what's the point of showing it?" You know, but you know, I know there's probably at least a thousand you guys who are just as big of a dork as me and love making survival kits. And, uh, you know, the Altoids, you know, have gotten kind of old over the years. You know, there's probably at least 10,000 videos showing Altoids kits. But with this new uh, tin, I thought, uh, you know, people might uh, kind of renew their interest in the survival kits. And definitely, if you guys uh, make a kit out of one of these, send me a link. I'd love to see what you guys do with them. And, uh, how you're doing it, but I, I really like this uh, end uh, design here, this little flip open end. It's a little more secure, I think, and just overall uh, neat, you know. Kind of, you know, it's really got me interested again in the little survival kits. You know, I haven't done one in a while, and I think uh, this is going to be uh, a nice fresh start.